But it's not like any of that time spent lost in the woods really matters, because it isn't long before the world ends and everyone dies. So that's for real. That actually does happen. But, chapter two! You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. But that's interesting. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Was the sky always those? You're here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. Like, what is that? Yeah! This! This is the thing! This- this is what- I noticed that! I have eyeballs! What are you talking about? I'm sure those walls are- <laughs> I've locked them! If there weren't any walls in the woods, someone might have gotten lost. Or, if did, someone other than you might have stumbled onto the princess. Oh, that's funny. If he doesn't remember what happened, then maybe it's best to keep it that way. Oh, do you think the narrator is not complicit what's going on here? Other me that I am talking with? I don't know. I think it's more fun if he knows what we're thinking. He's like a captive audience. Or we're a system. He might have walled off everything but the path to the cabin, but I'm sure there's plenty of other ways we can ruin his- Oh, again, you are eva over-evaluating how much I care if about the narrator. Day, you mean ruining everyone's day forever? Not doing yes, this just to I mess up with him. there are plenty of ways you could pull that off. I guess I'm just accepted that I'm going to be- talking over the narrator because there's text on screen if this bothers you mea culpa that's going to be the whole the series really did end last time didn't it we should be careful for all we know we just got lucky I mean, for all we know it just got reset not ended the world hasn't ended yet and you are never going to slay her with that attitude stuff those pathetic little voices to the back of your mind and stay focused on the task ahead hmm Honestly, I get oh, it. Warning. <laughs> Look at that you go any <laughs> Very subtle. <laughs> she will cheat, and she will do everything in her power to stop you from slaying her. Don't believe a word. Oh yeah, so uh, in case this wasn't clear, let's set up expectations here. I am not going to go out of my way to empty out conversation trees and all that. I am playing at a level that I feel is natural. I, like, as you can see, I'm just kind of following the natural flow uh, of, of what I feel is the story. And if this means omitting possibly chunks of stuff, you have to accept it. Uh, thank you for obliging me. If we're stuck going in there, maybe we should believe her. Maybe she isn't a liar. Ignore him. He's just being difficult for the sake of it. So is he part of me or is he like just another person Let's in the audience? Keep an open mind. You all have the same voice. Oh. Got a lot of options here. <laughs> okay, I, there's not a secret scroll up action. Tried to roll up there, it didn't do anything. The cabin interior is Whoa. wrong. A confusing yeah. pattern of many cabin interiors all projected across what's almost the same space. Yeah, you can see that it's by all shifted. the way things are moving. Here, a foot there, such that the seams are never quite visible enough for the place to make any sense. There's clearly a starscape in the floor. The only furniture of note is a plain table, its legs all the wrong lengths, its material devoid of feature. Perched on that table. Is a pristine so blade. so so would this look as messed up if I didn't mess up so hard in the start? But I'm clicking on the sword the and it's not doing implement. anything. You'll need it if you want to do this right. Wait, I came here to kill a princess and I did not bring my own weapon. If he wants us to take it, maybe we should just leave it to collect dust, or better yet, grab it and throw it out the window. Good as a knife against a world-ending monstrosity. Yeah, I'm not it? doing what the contrarian We're says to do. That's knife. stupid. Have you seen this place? We have literally no idea what to expect and no idea what we're dealing with. I've already told you what you're dealing with. You're dealing with a princess. 
How many times do I have to explain this incredibly simple I mean, and straightforward I mean, premise? Okay, you don't remember the fractal house on the hill here. You can't just say like, that. Like, we know it's oh, not just, name, like, so we know gone. something is going on. Listen to me. My job is to describe facts as facts and to guide you through your job, which is to slay the princess and, through that action, save the entire world. And if you're going to slay her, you cannot let fear creep into your heart. You cannot lose yourself before you even get to her. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. you've piqued my interest. What's going to happen if we lose ourselves? I wish I had the ability to interject when other people are having a full-on Nothing conversation inside my brain. To pull yourself together. Just ignore the stressful geometry and stay calm. I like the option to just just Ow. go in, Even grab the sword, and get in that door while they're talking. It to us. I'm not going to stop doing my job, so you're just going to have to get better at yours. And quickly, if you don't mind. Things got really meta yes, really take quickly. A deep breath. I'm all for getting under his skin, but we'll miss out on loads of fun if we shrivel up into a ball and go insane the first time we see something weird. We have seen something weird. What you're seeing here is obviously real. Just accept it and go with the flow. It really isn't hard. Okay. Okay, I'm fine. Good. Now, whenever you're ready, we're all waiting for you to complete a very important task. Uh, that's fair punishment. Uh, I'll just take the sword. You take the blade from the table. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. Again, like, w w did I seriously set out on this task without okay, a weapon? Fine, you took the knife. But you really shouldn't hold it like that. Then how are we supposed to hold it? The other way. Thumb at the bottom. You look much cooler and more serious if we hold it with our thumb at the bottom. I don't, I don't like him. I don't like Contrarian. It doesn't matter how you hold I don't like his baby. attitude. He's weird. Just make a choice. So, uh, no. Yeah, shut up, Contrarian. Keep your grip the way it is. Con contrary the Contrarian. Uh, sure. Ooh, we should look at ourselves. Wouldn't that be fun? Interesting that this isn't voiced. There's definitely a mirror. There isn't. Okay. You insisting it isn't there just makes me want to look at it even more. Yeah, I should have just looked instead of asking about it. Yeah, just whatever, y'all, y'all. Walk up to the wall next to the basement door. It's a wall. There isn't much to see here. Interesting. This really isn't funny. You reach Whoa! forward and rub your hand against the cabin wall. I hope you know how ridiculous you look right now. But it was there a second ago. And now it's gone. You know that taking the mirror away from us isn't going to change things, right? We'll find it again, and then we'll see whatever it is that you don't want us to see. Ah, oh, well. Let's get in. The door to the basement Jesus. creaks open, revealing <laughs> a web of branching staircases all built from unidentifiable materials. Made of stairs. Nothing here seems to belong. And the closer you examine your surroundings, the more confused you get. Your head throbbing with the effort of making sense of this place. None of the stairs even seem to go anywhere, let alone down. The air here has a sickening almost sludge-like miasma to it, the kind of indiscernible quality that comes from the blending together of every scent there is at once. An odor that is simultaneously everything and yet the sum of it all coalescing into a thick, nauseating nothing. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Her voice, a disquieting collage of tone and personality, drags up the stairs. Hello? Hi. You spoke in multiple voices at once. No, no, thank you. <laughs> oh, don't be such a baby. I don't want to do this. Let's just turn around and leave. This feels wrong. This feels like a trap. Like whatever we do, we're gonna die. But we already tried turning around and leaving, didn't we? And he threw up a wall. No way to go but forward. And whatever choice we make, whatever she is, 
we know one thing for sure. Almost feel like I wonder if I would start over without turning back. It's like, is that why everything is just like so weird so quickly? And what's that? That the fate of the world hinges on your success? There'll still be plenty of ways to ruin his day. Ah, let's just go right down the middle. You step onto the center staircase. Paths wind out around you in all directions, each step branching into its own staircases, which branch into their own staircases, and so on. You aren't quite sure if yours is taking you up or down, but at the very least, it's taking you somewhere. Honestly, yeah, look at those stairs. It is actually kind of hard to tell if it's stairs going up or down. That's pretty good. You concentrate on where you are. Careful not to stray onto any of the many splitting branches that tempt you on all sides. You wouldn't want to have to backtrack to yours once you'd made a decision that took you someplace else. Uh, stick to it. Systematic. And so you take one careful, focused step after another. One foot down, another foot down, another after that. You lose yourself in following the correct pattern, in following what looks to be the true path. The one that cuts straight down. Or up. Or maybe sideways. But no matter the direction it goes, it certainly is the most true path. You know that much. Yeah, see, that you slowly feels... lose sense of yourself the further Whoa. you go. Time disappears, and you can feel yourself begin to untether. Yeah, there things are definitely getting Physical less sensations detailed. Sensations dull and then vanish, until the only things experienced are the endless repeating patterns and emotions of the journey, a continuous march forward to a destination long forgotten. Consumption and betrayal, skepticism and blind devotion, rivalry and submission, terror and longing, pain and unfamiliarity, and at the heart of it all, an emotion that can only be described as... Can I help you? <laughs> That's pretty good. What? What is that? What happens? I feel so strange. Oh, that hard cut. Fundamentally different, but also still... The same person I was at the top of the stairs. Oh well, that was a trip, but now it's over. Time to get back to our old devilish ways. The princess, eyes bright but otherwise shrouded in darkness, watches you impatiently from the other side of the basement. Don't forget why you're here. Oh yeah, it's the name of the game, Slay the Princess. And uh, why are we here again? In case you weren't listening, I'm afraid I lost myself on the way down. <sighs> you're here to... He's just being an ass, we remember. Oh, I'm still not sure if we should trust you. Let's talk to her for a bit, try and get our bearings. Dude, seems... we just went through Esser oh. space. You know, self, that this is all sort of hecked up. Where's this a stab in face? It's not actually in here, huh? Uh... I don't remember what it was like before I was in this place. Why would I know what happened to you? Fair enough. We're probably oh. stuck down here forever, aren't we? Hi. There's no way out, and barely a way in. As the princess speaks again, it's almost as if she fractures. And where there was once just one of her, there is now another. Uh, thanks for spelling that I one out. do that? I don't like this. It's those cabins all over again. Can, can we put her back? Again? Have you been here before? Should we tell him? Nah, let him stew. Right, I'm telling him. Yeah, we've been here before, but we never went to the cabin. We just turned around and left. Until... Until? It's hard to describe. Until the only thing we could see was the same cabin going on forever. And then you told us that the world ended and we died. 
And then we woke up, and I'm pretty sure you're familiar with all the rest of it. It seems to me like you saw something you weren't supposed to have seen. If only you'd listened to whatever words of wisdom you were given in that other reality. But what's done is done, isn't it? Whatever you saw last time, unsee it. Whatever thoughts weaseled their way into your head, unthink them. If it's not already too late. You have a job to do here, and you need to do it now. Ooh, new plan! Let's see if we can make even more of her. Let's not. Uh, I want to know her name. Princess. Princess. It doesn't matter. I've been down here for so long. What's the point of a name if there's no one around to use it? I mean, I'm here now. All right. Whoa, you're selecting like everything at once here. Wait, that's not right. Yeah, like you were selecting like three different things. Go on. You take a step forward. Your foot lands, but it lands different. You experience a firm footfall, a gentle tread, a confident stride. You can feel yourself rupture. The room spins, your perception multiplying in a sickening kaleidoscope as your very self is pulled in incomprehensibly many directions. All at once you charge forward, knife gleaming to slay the princess just as you strike at her bindings and leave her to languish alone. Is this what the end of the world looks like? What an unbearable mess. But this... We, we can't... I think the game sort of took three things at once on purpose. Do you not have anything witty to say? I could use a good bit of wit right now. Oh, that is funny. No, I don't, because this isn't fun. How are we supposed to have fun if everything is happening at the same time? So, so, the same as so, so you couldn't tell. Is excruciating. But during the majority of everything here, I just had this widest grin on my face. As Lucky this was going on. Nothing and everything doesn't go on forever. The world and the princess collapse in on themselves before it all. Oh, yeah, your voice faded. Falls apart. I think he's gone. Seen one of them, she's free. The other one, I don't know. She's faceless. And this one, she's stabbed. I say this one because I'm pointing with a mouse. But you can't... Uh, we were never going to salvage this. You can't this, see my we? cursor. What happened to us? us? What are what we? Are we? There, there are parts, are parts of, us of us that are dead, dead and, and the others... And the they, they just, just don't, don't fit. fit. They just don't fit. We, we can, can feel them moving around, around in spaces they, they, they don't belong. belong. It's, it's all so uncomfortable. uncomfortable. Did, you Did you do this? this? Did, Did we, we do this? this? Can, can, can you pull, can us, you back pull us back apart? Can you fix us? Can you fix us? We should help her. I think we did this. Uh, I don't know. We're surprisingly sincere. I didn't actually think our actions had consequences. It's a little late for regret, isn't it? Please, please, please. 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 Huh. I don't know. Like, what's the best course here? I feel like I don't know. Like, I legitimately... What? She's gone. Where did she go? Should we try and find her? And where's that mirror up here? Why is it here? Why now? He is. Does that mean the world ended? I guess he's part of the world in a way that we are Again, not. What the hell are we supposed to do? I'm begging you, don't do this. Let's just do it. It's different now. It feels... I don't know. 
final. Let's mirror it up. Yeah, don't look at it. I don't like that thing. This, this doesn't feel right. It feels different. Final. Yeah, don't look at it. I don't like that thing. I, I have many choices. <laughs> Something finds me in the long quiet and brings me the gift of a fragile vessel. If we are talking, I can exist out of it. I am solitary lights in an empty city. What are you? I think that you are like me. We are oceans, reduced to shallow creeks. I have only just now stirred to consciousness. I could not have trapped you here, and I too yearn to be free. Nothing, as we are, but I know that there are worlds beyond us, and that we are meant to reach them. There is no exit, but this vessel is a creature of perception. She can make you forget, if only you believe her to be able to. Hmm. Bring me more perspectives, so that I may be whole. And perhaps then we will know our freedom. More than you have found, but less than there are to find. I am infinite. The rest will find their own way home. Everything until we meet again. You ask of things that cannot be done. To yeah, no, yes, you're right. I don't achieve, think the world gets destroyed, it gets reset. She asks that I tell you to remember her. You won't. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save. Saved here. That's today, and that's this date. And next time we'll pick up from here. Ooh, this was long! Uh-oh, I don't know if they're all gonna be long like this or what. But, uh, interrupting at any part up until this part just didn't make sense to me. I guess I'll... Oh, maybe I will. We'll see. Oh, this is fun. This is neat.